what's up folks it is Friday coming in on a Friday it was a beautiful day today work was good no issues no problems got a visitor got a visit from um, my upper management and that meeting was awesome also so now I am sitting in traffic trying to get home and um, I just got finished going to Trader Joe's and I got me some more aloe vera juice and some more coconut oil um, and I had got these um, this TV not it's not a TV dinner but it is a frozen food I'll show you guys that when I get home I cannot wait to eat that I'm gonna I think I'm gonna bust it open and eat it when I get home because I did not eat any lunch so I'm a little hungry and I got these like all natural um, dark chocolate graham crackers and um, it was pretty good with sea salt for the most part but anyway I'm about to get on the highway so I'll check you guys in a little bit what's up people so I made it to the house I changed and I wanted to show you these um, these little spanakopitas it's um i got it from trader joe's and it's like spinach and what does it say it's filled with spinach ricotta and feta cheese let me show you so i think i made them a little kept them in a little too long but they actually taste really, really good. They're a little crunchy, but the inside is really, really soft. Um, don't mind that. The little cheese fell out on it. That's why it's dark. But it was pretty good. But this is what the box looked like. It's this, um, this here, and I got it from Trader Joe's. It's pretty good. It's pretty, pretty good. So... Um, oh, I ended up also getting aloe vera juice, 100% aloe vera juice from Trader Joe's. And then I also needed to get some more um, coconut oil. I get this from Trader Joe's also. So, that is it. I will see you in a little while. I'm probably just going to chill out, watch a couple of movies. It is Friday. I really don't do a lot of vlogging on Friday. So um, I'm definitely going to watch a movie or two. And I'm sure I'm going to start editing this uh, video that I have ready to be edited. And then I'm going to be doing a lot of filming this weekend. And um, I have some volunteering to do tomorrow. And I'm actually going to be planting organ an organic garden for the inner city. I'm so excited about that. I love learning about organic things, food, and it just motivates me and encourages me to really start getting more into organic food. So I'm really trying to get more into organic fruits and vegetables. And hopefully pretty soon just go right into just like all natural organic products. I probably am going to always eat meat, um, but I'll try to eat meat that is farm fed, um, naturally fed, you know, grass fed type of thing. And um, yeah. All right. I will see y'all in a few. You want to say hi to, um... <laughs> you want to say hi to Divine? Hold on, here she is. Divine. No, I ain't tell you to come in here. Get out the kitchen. See how good she is? Look, I tell her to get out the kitchen. She just goes straight into her house. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys in a little while.
going to plant some fruits and vegetables in the garden and learn about organic vegetables. So it should be interesting. I'm gonna try to record while I'm there, but sometimes they can be a little sensitive about people, you know, like vlogging and stuff inside of these different venues for um, volunteering. So anyway, if it's not any children in there, then I will probably definitely vlog. I'll see you when I get out or I'll see you when I'm there. So I ended up coming up to meet Rico. He don't have to be at work for another hour and a half. So I came to meet him for some quick brunch, I guess. Um, no, it's, still, it's 10 o'clock, so, so for some breakfast before we head out. I was about to go get something to eat anyway, and he hadn't eaten, so before he go to work, I'm going to go ahead and go to Waffle House and get something to eat, so get all my stuff. I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, so um, we go have to rush off and go to work, so we ate, it was good. And I'm making a pit stop before I go home because I don't want to do it tomorrow because I got to work tomorrow. So I'm going to go to Ulta so I can get me a, um, I want to get that Anastasia, Anastasia or Anastasia Beverly Hill Brow Wiz Eyebrow Pencil Thingy, whatever. Heard so much about it on the reviews and on YouTube so I thought I'll go ahead and purchase it. I priced it and it's a little pricey. I'm used to like two dollar, a dollar eyebrow pencils but this thing is like twenty dollars. So this thing better be good. It better be good. That's all I know. So I'm back at the house as you can see and I need to do something with this. You see all of that? I'm like, where did all this brown stuff come from? Oh my gosh, I was disgusted. Y'all, that's makeup. You know how you pull the makeup up? And it just rolls up and up. I need to, that's, that's not cute. That's not cute. So I'm going to do an apple cider vinegar. Um, cleanse again today. That's going to get all the dirt and stuff out. Pretty much take my vinegar, put it in the spray bottle, mix it like two part or three part to one part. I put a lot of vin I put a lot of apple cider vinegar and not a whole lot of water. And then I'm going to balance the pH balance in my hair with um, aloe vera juice and coconut oil and um, almond oil and I think I got some jojoba oil I'm going to mix in that's going to bring my pH balance of my hair back and then all the curls going to be popping right now as you saw my hair has been in the bun for like two weeks I hadn't washed my hair in two weeks this time I was supposed to wash it last week but I was too tired Rico's birthday and I just didn't get time so I am making time today about to do it. I can't wait to do this. Oh, that's what the length check video. So a length check video, a twist out video, a story time video. I might even get an eyebrow video in there because I brought the um, Anastasia Beverly Hills eyebrow um, brow wiz. I cannot wait to show it. I might just, um, I might do a brow tutorial too. I don't know, we'll see. I got all day. I got a lot of all day filming and I'm gonna kick out a lot of videos today. So anyway, let me go ahead and get started on my hair. I just got finished. Um, um, oh, I also bought this little gadget. It's like an invigorator and it massages the scalp. Hold on, hold on, let me go get it. Okay, so here it is right here. It's, it's called a... Um, Scap Invigorator. I purchased this off of um, 
what website i'll link it below because i can't remember the website but um it got here in like six days this is what it looked like you put your finger in there like that you hear that and then you just put it on your scalp and so i've been doing that for about 10 minutes just without shampoo without anything and it's waterproof so you can use this as like a shampoo um, massager in the shower also so i'm definitely going to be using that today so anyway i'm about to go ahead and get started on my hair and so as you can see my hair is being conditioned deep conditioned what did i use i used um Shea Moisture's Jamaican Black Castor Oil, um, the deep conditioning mask, and I love this stuff. It really, really smells good. So, you know what? While I'm deep conditioning, I think I'm gonna make me some pancakes. I'm feeling like something sweet, um, but all I'm gonna have is the pancakes. I'm not gonna do sausage and eggs and stuff like that. But um, I'm about to start filming and um, I'll show you what my film stuff look like when I'm in the bathroom. Because I film in three different places in my apartment. So you're about to see the second place I film at. Alrighty. See ya. Oh my god, so good, so delicious. Hey, what's up? So, I am filming in the bathroom, and this is my setup. Yep, boxes and shoe boxes to get it up because. This cord right here is kind of short, so I need to prop my laptop up um, on something so it can reach. And there's my camera. I am almost finished. And um, let me show you what this looks like. I am using this program here. Well, first of all, I'm using the Nikon, the Nikon D3300. Um, 3300 and there it is. I use that particular um, <clears throat> program to allow me to use a viewfinder. It allows me to actually control, as you can see, I'm controlling it here. And then I this cord here that leads to my laptop it allows me to have control of my camera. So when I click that, you, you hear that? And there I am. I didn't want you guys to see me because you're gonna, I'm, I'm doing a video. So, but I just wanted to show you really, really quick what I use. And there I am, hello, hello, hello. And I am able to autofocus and everything right here. Hit this autofocus, click that, and it focuses. Look at that. I am so loving my new setup. Loving my new setup. I take it everywhere. This tripod here, it's a little tripod because the things that I do, I like to, the big tripods, they're just too big, and I like to sit things on top of counters and things like that. So, but anyway, I just wanted to come in real quick while I am filming to let you know what I'm doing. So, I will see you guys in a little bit. Let me go ahead and finish up this um, tutorial. Bye. All right, so I'm finished filming, and now I'm just trying to clean up this mess before Rico get home. I got stuff in the living room. I got stuff in the bathroom, stuff in the, in the bedroom. I did a lot of filming today, so... I'm trying to get everything cleaned up and um, I'm going to heat up that rotisserie that um, I purchased yesterday because I didn't get a chance to eat it yesterday. So I'm going to put that in the oven and maybe some rice. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm hungry. I'm hungry. 
I'm hungry. I have to work tomorrow. I'm probably going to chime in tomorrow just for a little bit. But um, and I think I'm going to do one more tutorial to tomorrow. I'm going to do an eyebrow tutorial. All right, so let me go ahead and finish this up before we go get home. And I'll see you guys either later on or tomorrow. What's up? It's like 5 o'clock in the afternoon on Sunday. It's never too late to say happy Sunday. I had to work today. Yes, another weekend. Two weekends in a row I worked on Sunday. So I'm not going to be doing that anymore no time soon. But it was good to get the extra money. You know, um, I get time and a half. And so I'm excited about that. But I just wanted to come on in here because I need to do my hair. Uh, I've been so lazy about putting these crochet braids back in my hair. But I'm going to go ahead and do that today. It's going to take me like three hours. Um, so I'm just going to really just go ahead and get started. Because if I don't get started, if I sit down, I'm not going to do it. So I'm just going to just go ahead and... Get started with it. I'm gonna keep some music. That always keeps me motivated. If oh, if you want to know how to put in crochet braids or how I put in my crochet braids, um, I have a video on my channel. You can definitely check it out. I'll link it somewhere, either up here or in the description box. Um, oh, that's kind of cute. That's kind of cute. Oh, is that cute? I think it's cute. Look like a like a messy poof. I don't know. Kind of look like Sideshow Bob though. Like you remember Sideshow Bob from um, The Simpsons? Homie the Clown sidekick. All right. I'm excited that my hair is growing though. I'm like really excited about that. Really excited. I did a lip check video that's going to be coming out real soon. But yeah, my hair is really, really growing. Look at that. That is like, damn, I'm here. And that's not even pulling from the bottom. That's pulling like up here. So, all right, anyway, I don't have any more cleaning to do. I did all of that Friday and Saturday. So, all I do is just put these braids and relax, listen to some music, enjoy the rest of this Sunday, and I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome week, and I will see you in the next video. Mm, mm, mm. Have a blessed one. Have a blessed one. Have a blessed one. Have a blessed one. Uh, have a blessed one. Have a blessed one.